Welcome to another episode of Blade Runner Tool Sharpening's Before and After. I was just called in to a new restaurant, and uh, well, new for me, and um, the previous uh, manager, chef, whatever, had someone else doing the, the, the work for them, and this is what is coming out with some of some of these sharpeners. I mean, they're, they're, they're knocking off the tips. I'm not sure I understand what that's all about, but I went in and asked the chef, it's like, what, what's going on here? Did you want this done purposefully or, or is he said, no, we really don't want, so I'm going to have to fix those. I've started on one of them already. This one was really bad. I mean, it came out to here and just did a drop off. So I've started on, on working on some of that and trying to get a, a point on them and trying to get them straightened out as much as I can because they were half mooned for crying out loud. So I'll be back with my results in a minute. Okay, we're back, and those knives I was telling you about from this restaurant, um, I finished those up. Came out pretty good. This one was, there was nothing left of that tip. I mean, whoever had sharpened it before had blunted it for some odd reason, and um, so I rebuilt it, put a new tip on that. I straightened it out also. These, all of them were humped really bad. This one was the worst. It was probably a good half inch knocked off the tip. So I was able to bring that back. Plus, it was it was the worst half moon I've ever seen. <laughs> I straightened it out as best I could, and then I had to follow it whatever was left so I didn't narrow out the knife way too much. And then uh, this one here came out really nice also. What I do is I, I knock down the, the spine so I don't take off so much material, trying to bring it down to um, where there's a, a point area. And uh, I was able to uh, maintain their the length of their knife for them. And then the last one here, this the, that one was a tip also. It was just it was it was down to about down to there. So same thing. I I take the back of the spine off so I don't uh, uh, take off so much so quite so much off of their um, uh, knife itself. Um, also on on one of these here, they gave me three of these and every one of them was like a half moon. Now I understand that they some of them like to have that roll, but most of them prefer the flat. So when you're doing this, you're always got you have more contact with your um, cutting board. So that's what I did there. I mean, I, I straightened it out as best I could, and of course, you know, with a half moon like that, it's, you're going to take way more knife off than you really need to. So um, that's there you have it. Another episode of Blade Runner Tool Sharpening's Before and After. Hope you enjoy the video. Uh, like us on Facebook if you get a chance, and remember, with Blade Runner, there's never a dull moment. <laughs>